Christmas at least, it is more snow, which isn't always the easiest to get around, but it's better than ice. Carl? In Selma Sports Authority. Okay. And then here at, um, at Soul Sports, they sell them. So you're going to actually try to come down that forearm there. Oh, even more? Uh, okay. It's more pressure there, and we're going to roll up and down. <laughs> Careful there, Alexis. You're I know, roll up I know. And down. When you find a tender part, yeah, I can um, feel it right there. Then you want to stop there. You don't want to roll fast over. You want to go nice and slow. That means there's an adhesion or a knot there. Uh -huh. And if you don't take care of that, it's going to lead to future knee problems, feet problems, hip problems, okay, and uh, could prevent you from. Injury. And injury. it's not just the IT band. You use this on all your muscles, right? Absolutely. So we have we have the calves. Calves usually gets get really tight. I'll show a couple stretches here in a second, but the calves are a big one to roll out. And uh, then also you have your shins right here. Some people experience the shin splints like right. myself. The shins are a big one to roll. So and after uh, the run, you make sure you focus on the parts especially that are giving you some problems. And you want to be really careful if, you're, if it's your first time rolling not to do too much because you can actually bruise the muscle because it gets oh, really deep, yeah. like a deep tissue massage. I can feel the burn. <laughs> now, you have another thing that you could yeah. get um, at home it's called this the stick yeah this is called the stick I actually learned about it here um, from Lance the the owner of soul sports mm -hmm. and I've never seen it before but I use it on myself and my patients it's great like one of these? It's a, yeah it's a little bit less intense oh and yeah you can roll after runs you can get the quads, uh -huh. you can even go over on um, the upper body into your neck. Oh, yeah. You have somebody do it on you, and it, it works, works really well. there is soreness in your upper body as well. It's not just the legs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's amazing how much your shoulders and arms you use when you run. Okay, now show us a couple quick stretches we yeah, should be let's, doing. Let's start with the calves. This is okay. um, this is probably one of the most important for post-run. It's not as important before the run to do a ton of stretching, but... Thank you so much for helping us out today. Hopefully you're all set for the P.F. Chang's Rock and Roll Arizona Marathon and Half Marathon. I'm doing the half, all right. so I'm going to have these with me at the end. You going to be there? I will be there for sure. All right, cheering me on. Right, Thanks, Richard. <laughs> Back to you guys. All right, that's good advice. It is great I'm advice. I'm waiting for them to... As he stated, with businesses 